Cruel and cold. That's what the attorney for Timothy Taylor calls the FBI's handling of the disappearance of Brittany Drexel. Taylor's attorney filed a lawsuit against the Department of Justice and says that for years the government recklessly pursued Taylor as the prime suspect in the disappearance of Drexel. Now, Drexel was visiting Myrtle Beach on spring break in 2009 when she disappeared. Timothy Taylor's name was first brought up in the Drexel case after an FBI agent testified that a jailhouse House informant claimed Taylor was involved. It wasn't until 2022 that Raymond Moody confessed to kidnapping, raping and killing her at a campsite in Georgetown County. Well, the lawsuit claims the federal investigators had evidence that linked Moody to the crime, yet the agency continued investigating Taylor. I've never seen the FBI be this um, this reckless before, and then I've never sort of seen this level of um, just cold cruelty just passively letting letting this damage that they've established um, continue to happen because if Raymond Moody hadn't come in and confessed it doesn't look like they had any plans to tell anybody anytime soon. Well Taylor's attorney says that this is more than just having Taylor's name cleared by federal officials it's about holding the FBI accountable.